We share the idea of general devising for graph-based collaborative filtering via adversarial graph dropout. As we all know, personal recommendation has been at the core of many online applications. Graph-based collaborative filtering is the most popular approach. It views user item interaction as a graph, hiring multiple graph convolutional layer to iteratively aggregate information among multi-hub neighbors. However, this interaction graph usually contains biased user item interactions, and such biases could be amplified through the GN mechanisms. Hence, graph-based CF models suffer from bias accumulations. We consider a real example here. From the first three columns, there is an increasing trend of clustering based on user gender and item popularity with additional of layers in graph-based collaborative filter methods, such as MF, LiJSON with two layers, LiJSON with four layers. And this trend suggests that as the number of layers increases, although recommendation performance improves, the dependence on sensitive attributes such as gender and popularity becomes stronger. This indicates an increase in learned bias. And for the biasing method, we want to develop a general biasing method that reduces the model's reliance on the sensitive attributes attributes and at the same time not sacrificing the model's recommendation ac accuracy. And we propose Edward Job. Edward Job has two training states. The first one is the biased representation learning. So we imply a bias measurement function PB here to quantify the bias of each interaction. And we sample bias aware and bias mitigated subgraphs by performing random edge dropout according to PB or 1 minus PB. And this neighborhood aggregation is then separately performed on the subgraph views. On the view specific representations, a contrastive learning loss is minimized between them to ensure representation level invariance. And the second stage is bias identification. So we need to identify the PB here. We propose an adversarial learning approach, which learn PB by adversarially maximizing the divergence between the bias aware and bias mitigated representations. More interesting example experiments results can be found in our paper.